Hey guys and welcome to another video. So you're looking to get the best performance out of your PC. Well one way to do that is through making sure that you're utilizing a high performance power plan. If so far you only had available 3 power plans within Windows, the power saver, the balance mode and the high performance mode. Starting with update 1803, Windows introduced a new power plan which is called Ultimate Performance. In this video I'm gonna show you how to activate this power plan on your PC or how to enable it if you don't have it available. There are some controversies whether this plan actually brings anything on top of the high performance power plan but my suggestion is that you try it on your own and see if this brings any extra frames per second in your favorite game. Let me show you how to do this. Let's start by right clicking on the Windows button then selecting settings. In the box over here go and type edit power and select edit power plan. Go in the power options. You might already have it available just click on see additional plans to see whether you have it or you don't have it on your computer. As you can see it is not available on my computer so I will need to enable it. In order to do that just click on the start button and start typing cmd, open up the command prompt and then type this exact command. You will find it in the description of the video so just copy paste it onto your command prompt and hit enter. As soon as you execute this command you will see that ultimate performance power plan has been added to your computer. If you go back into the screen and just press F5 to reload or this button over here you will see ultimate performance plan appearing on your screen. Just go ahead, select it and that's it. You have ultimate performance plan activated on your computer. If you find this plan not working for you for whatever reason and you just want to go back to some other plan, you can simply go in here again and select for example high performance or balance mode. If you want to make sure you're completely deleting this power plan from your computer, what you have to do is first of all select another power plan, then click on change plan settings and then go for delete this plan. It will ask you whether you want to do so, ok and there you have it, the power plan is gone. This is it guys, I hope this was helpful for you, if it was as always drop a like and a comment down below and subscribe for more interesting videos like this one. Have fun!